Hey everyone, welcome back to a little meaty craft. I know it's been a little bit. Um, I was letting my uh, mine colony builders build in my Yogbox world and in Hexit. Oh, I'm just frustrated with the chocobos. I can't seem to breed the right colors. They just keep plopping out the yellow ones. So I thought I'd come back in here and take a look around um, my little town area here and see see if I can remember what I was working on. So let's uh, let's head over there and see what things are looking like. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This guy right here looking pretty good. Um, thinking about probably I don't know, maybe another I wanted it to be big. Like one more layer like this and then a domed roof possibly. I don't know. That thing is things are work in progress. The other thing I was contemplating whether I should maybe move maybe not completely move but kind of move over into the castle as my home even though I've traditionally always set my home up on the hill here and the castle is a little bit it's a little bit whack in a way it's a little weird I mean it it looks good looks pretty good it's symmetrical now which is good it's all symmetrical I you know what I need to do is I need to put some kind of peaks up on the top of those two things because they're a little bit squared off but I wanted to I wanted to go over there actually I don't have an entrance from here so we're gonna have to drop down this way oh I'm hungry 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 hippo too much running around so this the original house here you know it just it was the first thing we that we built here you know, it was it's kind of weird, kind of weird shape. It didn't really stand out like I wanted it to as far as into the side of the mountain. So that's why I was saying, ah, it's not that big of a deal if I move over into this bad boy. I mean, that thing looks pretty good. The stairway going up and um, I think I got most of, I got a lot of materials over there. I haven't been over in, oh, what's that? It's a little stone. Uh, stone. Six stone, you are you are beasting, sir. Uh, wood, cobble, cracked stone bricks, huh? Been using much of that stuff. Uh, do I have? Where would I have wool? Do I have any wool? Oh yeah. Oh, derp! I got plenty of wool. Let's see. And I probably want to take some of these things. Some stairs. Maybe some glowstone. Anything else? Fence? I don't think so. Um, let's see. Let's make a bed to take over. Actually, let's make two beds. I can't make two beds. I didn't get enough wool. Give me some more wool. Alright, make another bed. Broop. And broop. Two beds. We'll go see if we can find ourselves a nice little... Whoa! Whoa, what was that? Did you guys see like a little whirlpool thing going on right there? Oh yeah, right... Oh my... When I took water out of there, it messed up. I thought I dove down deep enough. Right here, I took water. I'm gonna have to remedy that. I shall remedy that, sir. I think that it looks pretty good. I mean, oh, there's a lot of work to be done on that that face, but I mean, it's looking pretty good. Let's see, where was my good chest? All right, oh, we got some wood for days in here, and stone bricks, stone, stone. Not using much cobble in here. It's mostly stone. All right, so we've got. I mean, we've got the little. Uh, we got these little walkways here, obviously, to get up on this thing. We've got the ladders in here to get up top to the little watchtowers that we have. I mean, nothing really going on in here, kind of just for looks. But I did make a staircase in here, I believe. So see, we got this big, huge area here we could do something with. I don't know. It's it's almost too big for a one-person house. This this castle would make a a good place for like 10 or 20 people but this area here and then the next level I got another staircase going up and then I, I have this thing going all the way up to those top pieces 
Here's where I was thinking about maybe like a bedroom. Maybe like this. Put a bed in there. This could be like an enchanting area. Then you could walk out in the morning. You're like, oh, good morning. Good morning, meaty craft. I don't know. I kind of sentimental to that little hovel of a house over there now that I've been. Even though I've been building castle type structures and buildings and rotundas. Still am partial to my my first um, my first little like hovel. I call it a hovel. My first little thing that I built there. Let's go ahead and make some. Uh, I didn't get any of the cruddy wood, huh? Let's make um, two doors. Some doors in this thing right here. All right, got some doors. Maybe throw a chest up here too. Probably not a bad idea. Me likes to have a chest in stone. All right, we're good. The only problem with rooms like this is there's no windows. You know, it's not like I guess I could put paintings all over the walls. Maybe I could put like a secret entrance here and put a painting over it. I guess it wouldn't be so secret now that I kind of told everybody. This this thing here is just like for looks. I'm thinking about if I block this in here like so. Let's just block this in. We'll make this like a little secret room or a room. I don't know what's what my kick with is about saying everything's secret. It's just a room. Let's see how are we lined up here? We could make that a um could make it a potion room. We could make it an enchanting room. Tons of stuff down there. Then up top, we got these little places, which aren't the safest thing to walk out to the edge. Gives you a good view of the world, though, or the uh, town, the area. Some of these buildings are pretty random. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes I look back at things and I don't know exactly what I was thinking. I don't know, that still is kind of cool over there. Hey, can I jump down to there? Probably kill myself. Just trying to decide... Um, what the heck was that? I'm trying to decide what to do with this world. Like, if I should continue building in here. Um, if I should start something new. Now, I did update this to 1.6.2. Uh, I don't know... If horses, if they'll just, do they just spawn? Do they just spawn anywhere? Or is it, if it's like the typical thing, if you already have like a, oops. If you already have a world generated, do you have to go out somewhere? I wouldn't think so. That's usually with ore and, re, you know, different resources and stuff. But I guess I haven't played in here a whole lot to see if possibly any, any horses would uh, would spawn in. And maybe, maybe there's something I, I totally don't even know about them. Because to be honest with you guys, I've been running, you know, so many modded series that I, I didn't really pay attention to the the latest, you know, default type upgrade with our update with what's going on with horses. Like, do you have to breed them? Do, you, do they just spawn? I'm just, I don't know. I'm just kind of going over here to look and see if I can see anything out in a field anywhere. Like, the, oh yeah, there's a big flat area. I don't know if they, they spawn in, in any particular place either. Oh, get, gosh, get owned from distance. Hit. Any horses around? Hello? Chickens? We got a, uh, a zombie that likes gold, apparently. That's what he said. Just, I like gold and it's proven by... Me catched on fire. Caught on fire. I love fighting mobs. <laughs> I don't remember that big old hill right there, though. To be honest with you. Mm -mm -mm. Weez don't like the creep. Oh, that was a... The bow seems to fly so good in, in regular Minecraft compared to some of these mods that I've been doing. I guess it's... There's like a... <clears throat> What do you call it? Uh, more bows, like special bow mods and stuff. They just don't work like default. Oh, look at the world. Anything good down there? Always try and get a, a sneak peek of... What 
is that? Sometimes the just normal stuff down there looks like something really special, but it's not. What the heck? Is that a hill missing right here? Oh, yeah. Oh, there it is. Hello, hill. <laughs> Haven't been over here. Maybe it's like, ah, I don't know how to... Got a whole jungle over here. Oh, I can look down in there again. See anything special? Some big openings. Nothing... Nothing too spectacular. I want to go up on this hill here. I don't think it's going to be... Oh! Easiest thing to get up to, though. So, yeah. I, like I said, I've got... Um, I've got the Hexit thing going on. Obviously, we've got Yogbox going on. Uh, I've got... You know, Meatycraft and Tekkit are still kind of lingering around. We talked about Tekkit in the last video of Yogbox. Like, what to do... Probably, probably what I might, what I've kind of come to the conclusion is, hop in there when you feel like playing, and when you, when you got an idea of something, you know, maybe something cool that you, that you want to make, you know. So it's not just going in there and bleep or blue, you know, same old thing over and over again. Is that that's not a horse? That's a cow. You guys are probably like, dude, you can't even find horses. You're not gonna find any horses. Is that the only thing too? I probably should just look and see what the what was in the update. I know it's been out for a while now, but again, I've been I've been doing so many other things. He disappeared. So this should be some monstrous cliff here. I could just see it. After all this time, I'll be standing here looking down, talking, and all of a sudden, bam from behind. Remember, this is like my um my mob spawning area and also my tree farm was was I, what I use this area for here I just I don't see any kind of horses anywhere yeah I'll have to figure out like what the deal with those are not that I haven't been riding horses and chocobos anyway man it's not like it's there's a lot why is there so many creepers right here it's creeper central welcome back to meaty crap oh I almost did a jump I don't know why I would have done that. <clears throat> Let's head back to civ civilization. All these pigs. What are you guys doing hanging around the, the lava pit? What are you doing hanging around the lava? He just doesn't want to go in the pit. Why don't you get in the pit? And you, music lava. Mm. Hey, you get a bow and arrow fight? I don't think so. He Get away from me. There's a lot of mobs. Now you know why I call this my mob fighting area. Where uh, when I wanted to farm XP, this. Seriously? Seriously? Ser Dude, there's. There's a lot of mobs. Dude, there's a lot of mobs here. I hate skeletons. They might become officially my most hated thing because of their stupid knockback on their bows. Oh, you missed. Oh, you hit. Mm. Do not like the knockback. That guy's got an enchanted bow. Enchanted bow! You're both on fire, you and your... Did you just shoot at me? Over your head! Oh, I gotta eat. Gotta eat! Oh, I just like... I like battling around. I did so much building for so long. It's like... I've just been on kind of a battle kick lately where I just want to fight mobs and do stuff like that. But I do miss the creative side of building. Um, I'm on the wrong side of this. His nice looking... It actually looks pretty cool just like it is. Like an unfinished... Like it was... Um, like someone had commissioned me to build... I commissioned you to build the Rotunda of Doom. And it's like... We ran out of funds. It's... It's unfinished. What is that noise? Why did I have ender people up there? Got stone for days. Oh, okay, yep. Yeah. Must have been cooking. Oh, yeah. Cooking up some stone. Stone. Stone and stone. All right. We're just been making bricks and stone and everything. Oops. Don't get my food back. That's for all this stuff. Just cooking nonstop cobble. Oh, there's our cobble. Five, six, seven, eight. How many do I have? Hey, I'm out of coal. What the heck? I don't usually use buckets of lava. I know that 
A lot of people use buckets of lava. I guess if you had a really hard time finding coal, it would be um, something to do. But I don't know. I just use coal. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Alright. We gotta get this stuff fired back up. Because we gotta... There, I go through so much of these um, stone blocks. You just gotta keep cooking stone. And then making stone blocks. And you'll be good. Just like that. See? We'll have another eight sets of 64. I miss my having my teleporting sword. I like I like that. I really like that. Two, you know, I would teleport off. Now I just fall down. You feel like, man, this just isn't working out for me. Just isn't working out for me. I know I've been. I just I really haven't done anything this episode besides run around and. I'm just re-familiarizing myself with Meatycraft here. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I should I continue to expand upon this area? I know some people said that I haven't, you know, really finished an area like this since the very first Meatycraft where I did I did a nice really big city. And in that one, what was so crazy about it is I did like two other big cities too, or at least two, maybe three. I don't know, but there the one main city was pretty cool. It's it's where I had put the spawn area. I think it's still it's still there for download. If if you guys I wonder if has anyone have <clears throat> does anyone have that first world and have it upgraded all the way up to one point six? Problem is there it was so big. I had so much of the area spawned that a lot of the resources you wouldn't you wouldn't be able to get just because it was so it's so old and such a big world. You're gonna die in a second anyway. I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about um, about this? I mean, how long? I always had had shrunk the episode or the series. Hey, I got some arrows in me. Where I didn't make more too many. I don't even know what what episode number we're on in Meatycraft, but um, this is definitely our bu you know build. You want you like building? This you come to Meatycraft. That's where I do all my building. Or most of my building, at least. I'm doing a lot of building in Yogbox too now. I don't. I th what do you guys think of the castle? I think it's pretty good for its size, like for what it started off as, just that single pillar. But I definitely need to put some stuff up there on top, up there. I need to put something, you know, if not something like that, something a little bit more pointy. You know what I mean? A little pointy. It's a pointy. All right, let's go. I want to take a look at that. Take the quick way up to the top. It does look pretty good though, and it's taken a long time to um, to do a lot of this to expand this area so much. I don't know, I just been a, a little bit, just a little bit indecisive about what I want to do with different series and things. You know, what I really want to do is besides Minecraft and besides Skyrim, I want I want a a game that I can play, do like a let's play play through whatever i want to be able to play a game but like a fast like i want to play borderlands you know but it would be solo just so i can get you know do some fast fun stuff i don't know i might do that i don't know people give me a hard time though about bringing other people in you know but you know i just it's hard for me because of the timing and stuff so i just got some thinking to do uh on what i want to do with these series i just i hate having a series like Meatycraft not you know, kind of just sitting here and not doing anything with it. But hope you guys like this little random. <laughs> this is, was really random episode. Didn't really do anything, but I was contemplating moving into that castle over there. But I'm feeling like heartfelt emotion about my little my little house here. So maybe I'll I'll probably put something in there, might make it like it would be lived in by by other people, but not by me. Media will stay in his house, and I will um. I think I'll put up like wood walls and stuff and make rooms in there. Maybe we'll do something like that. Try and do do, do some different colors and different things with uh, not really colors, but the wood versus the stone. I think it'll look cool inside there. So, all right, guys, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. You guys know Meatycraft is a little bit different. We just kind of jibber jaw about random things and and hang out together. So if you're still here, I appreciate you guys being here, and I'll I'll see you guys next episode. <laughs>